Come on in. Hi foodies, welcome to Food Things. Surprisingly, I've got a few requests from people who ask me how do you make smooth pop, pop without lumps. I'm not perfect, but this is how I do mine. You will need one liter of cold water or warm water and three cups of maize meal. And for cups, I do not mean mugs, the ones that you use for coffee. I mean cups, the ones that's used for tea. They are quite smaller than the mugs, so or else buy cup measurements. They are also available in PEP. Like you've seen in the beginning of this video clip, you will see that I took water from the tap and I took from the warm water so that temperature is quite enough for me start off by adding one cup of maize meal to warm water i'm using a smaller cup half a cup that's why you see me adding two cups to the water stir it in until it thickens a bit and cover for at least 10 minutes after 10 minutes you will have a creamy pop just like on the clip now put the lid back on for another 10 minutes At this stage, start adding the second cup and stir it in nicely. It's easier for me using a wooden spoon. You can use a whisk if that's your preference. Beat the pup against the walls of the pot to smoothen out any lumps, any possible lumps. What makes pup to cook up perfect is the amount of steam in your pot. So make sure you have a pot that locks in the steam or use a three-legged or a cast iron pot three-legged for outside obviously or a cast iron pot on the stove top to have that smooth non-stick pop. Cover for the next 10 minutes. At this stage, the pup has thickened, so use the last cup uh, of flour 
just to make the pop firmer just to have that firm consistency Allow me to make a disclaimer. I did not put butter into the pup. You can use you can put butter into the pup if you so wish. I'm using yellow corn flour, yellow corn maize meal. This is how I make the round shape pup. Wash out the bowl to prevent sticking. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Remember to subscribe.